Okay, so now let's talk a little bit about the word problems. So in this problem, I want to find the relative rate of change. So the population in millions of a city t years from now is given by the following function. Okay, so that's what we have. Uh, P of t is equal to 6 plus 1.7 e to the 0.05 t. And what we want to find is find the relative rate of change of the population eight years from now. Okay, so if you remember the formula, uh, the formula to find the relative rate of change is the following. So we know that the relative rate of change, I'm going to write it as RRC, is going to be the derivative of the function divided by the original function. Okay, that's what the relative rate of change is. Okay. So in order for me to do this, I have to take the derivative of my population function and divide it by the total function. Okay, that will give me the relative rate of change. Okay, so the derivative of the function is going to be what? So the, the 6 is going to go away, so we're going to have just to take the derivative of 1.7e to the 0.05t. So the 1.7 really isn't going to do anything. I'm going to leave it there. And the derivative of e to the t, if you remember, derivative of e to the t or e to the x, whatever, it's still going to be e to the t. So I'm going to have e to the 0.05t, and then I'm going to multiply it by the, by the derivative of the inside, which is this part, which is going to be 0 0.05. Okay, then I'm going to divide it by uh, 6 plus 1.7e to the 0.05t. Okay, so you need to take the, be able to take the derivative of the por portion on top first. Okay, so let me clean this up a little bit. Let me multiply 1.7 times 0 0.05. And what I'm going to get is 0 0.085e to the 0.05t all over 6 plus 1.7e e to the 0.05t okay now what we're looking for is we we want to find the relative rate of change which is what we just found what we want to do is now plug in 8 so we want to know okay what is the actual value at t is equal to 8 so i'm just going to plug that in it's going to be 0 0.085 e to the 0 0.05 times 8 divided by 6 plus 1.7 e to the 0 0.05 times 8. Okay, so this is just a monster of a problem. So just go ahead and just use your calculator, plug all that in. Uh, second e, okay, so I'm going to get e to the power of uh, 0 0.05, okay, times 8 divided by 6 plus 1.7 e to the power of 0 0.05 times 8. Okay, so hopefully I got all of that right and just double check and what i got approximately is 0 0.015 okay so approximately that's what it is so that is the relative rate of change if i wanted this in a percentage i would just multiply this by 100 and the relative rate of change is about 1.5 percent okay so that's all there is to relative rate of change all you have to do is use a formula plug in the numbers take the derivative and then plug in the the value of t